How's it going everybody? Hope you're having a wonderful day. Today's a really quick video. We're going to discuss something that does not cost a lot of money and super easy to do. What is that? Be right back and tell you. open this up maybe it gives a little bit more sunlight I'm sitting in my my fifth gen Camaro and but this applies to any and every car that is owned or, or or known to man we like to personalize them we like to make them our own and so I, I thought well let me show you how to mod your car now I know you're automatically thinking wow mod my car that's gonna be expensive not really the mods I'm going to show you today one or two of them I have personally done. I have one or two more I'm, I've got coming. And then the other ones are some that I want to do. And they're all under $50. I got one at the end that is $60, bucks, $59.95. But the rest of them are under $50. As a matter of fact, most of them are under $25. So let me show you what, got, what we got going on. Man, I tell you what a difference a couple days make. Man, the temperature's dropped. It's been windy right behind that last hurricane. Oh, man, what a difference. But here we go. The, let me get up front and I'll show you the very, very first thing. Like I said, we like to personalize our vehicles. And that includes me. Paolo Behar. Now his channel name is Mall Crawling Ain't Easy. Sent me the bow tie off of his Z01. The cool thing about his bow tie, it, it's, it's wrapped. It's got a carbon fiber wrap on it. It doesn't have the big old gold bow tie. So that's mod number one, wrapping your bow tie. So what I did was I went on eBay, found a place that sold the carbon fiber vinyl, and applied it to my other bow tie, the one on the back, to make it look even, to make it look good, to make it match. Look at how much better that looks. So that's mod number one. And this was under $8, I think it was $7 and some odd change I'll, sh I, I'll put the links and pictures and everything to all this stuff in the video but it was under eight bucks mod number one i'm gonna walk up to my other car to show you this because like i said this can be for any vehicle but in particular we are talking about the fifth gen but what i'm going to show you can be on any car and that is vinyl lettering right vinyl lettering it can be the whole side, the whole rear of your window. The bigger, the more expensive it costs. But typically a banner, like the one that goes across the front of your windshield, is normally like 20 bucks. Something like that, under 10 bucks. Instagram, Instagram names, Facebook uh, page name, YouTube channel name, name of your car, name of your favorite product, doesn't matter. That's mod number two. Vinyl decals, vinyl lettering, vinyl numbers for your car. Now, if you look at the exterior of this car, it's dirty. But, hey, you know, all the rain and stuff and the hurricanes and stuff, I can't, I can't complain. But you can buy tent to go on this. Rather than spending a couple hundred bucks to replace these lights, right? You can buy tint to put on. Some of them has emblems cut out, like the bow tie cut out in it, so that you still get a little bit of orange through it. But the rest of it will be black, right? Side marking kits, very very cheap. The tint on eBay you can get for like five to seven bucks. You could do the front and the rear. Doesn't matter, and make your car that much darker, make it look that much cleaner, make it look that much sleeker. Next mod up, right? I've done lost track of numbers, so I'm just going to insert the number on the screen somewhere. But next mod up. You look at these cars, they look really cool, you know, down the sides. The body styling and everything of these cars just... Mm, the fifth gen is such a popular design. 
Now, if you look at this and think about the old cars, the side of this represents the 69. It's got the gills, right? And that is the next mod. Most of the gills on the 69 were either chrome or painted. But some people like to add a touch of color. Like my car has white stripes. I could put white gills right here. I could put black gills right here. I could put carbon fiber gills right here, right? But yes, putting gills on your car. Now there's a lot of other vinyl that you can do to this car. You know, you can put vinyl on this piece right here all the way down. You could put hockey um, stripes all the way down and everything. But, you know, getting up into that stuff is 100 bucks or more. So that's why I'm not mentioning those. The ones I'm mentioning today is 50 bucks or below. Like I said, most of them are 25 or below. But anyhow, cheap mods. back at the back of the car again right it's like we're going backwards all the time I just don't get it <laughs> but that's where we're gonna finish out most of our mods okay the next one up shows a little personalization and it can be had in almost any color artistic custom your favorite team your favorite baseball team basketball team football team your car like SS or LT L, uh, LT1, Z01, any of that stuff. And what am I referring to? License plate frames. Yes, sir. License plate frames. Make your car that much more personable. And it's just, it's, it, it is so great to do. And it's really cheap. And, that, and they're a lot better quality than what they used to be. You know, used to, they was all plastic. Not now. They're kind of a heavier pot metal. And some of them are actual chrome. But anyhow, with that said, next mod, license plate frames. Back to the front of the car. Yes, sir. Back to the front. Back to the bow tie, as a matter of fact. I kind of flip-flop between my bow ties. I still have the original gold one that was on here. Now I've got the carbon fiber one that, like I said, Paolo sent me. But there's also another option. Not to have a bow tie at all. Yes, sir. The next mod is the bow tie delete mod. I've seen them run anywhere from $19.99 to $24.95 all the way up to $40. Bucks, okay? Like I said, it's under 50 bucks, so that's why I'm including this mod. It cleans up the whole front of the car and everything, and it just makes a, you know, cleaner look and all that crap. But yeah, bow tie delete. Next mod. Yeah, it's super cool, super easy. I've actually got a video on it. If you care to check the videos, if I remember, I'll put it up there. But if not, look through my videos. Bow tie delete. That's all you got to type in the search, and it'll bring it right up. Now this next mod is for a car, for the 5th gen, early 6th gens that have the brake light mounted into the either the spoiler or to the back deck lid. And it is again another cover. Vinyl, decal, sticker, however you want to look at it. You can get it customized with your name. You can get it customized with your car, like Camaro, SS, or like I could get it put my channel name in it, Camaro Time. Right across there, it's blacked out. The only thing you see is the letters when I hit the brakes. Really cool. Again, under $25. I think, it's, I think those are like $24.95. But anyhow, under $25. Super great touch to make the whole back of your car match. And while we're back here, we're going to stay back here. <sighs> Let's get back here. Next up, next mod. Very simple, easy to apply, and makes such a huge difference. If you look at this car, like I said, I have the, the vinyl on the bow tie now. Super easy to put on. But you had this black stripe. And what that represented back in the day when these cars were actual muscle cars, anytime you saw this black stripe on the back of a Camaro, you knew that that car was equipped with a big block engine. You knew not to mess with it. Well, if you follow that across, some people like the way this looks. You know, it goes from black to chrome to red right to some people that just do disrupts the whole flow so what am i getting at tent for your tail lights a company called fast tech actually makes a kit and you can buy them on ebay also they fit perfect they're already pre-cut they fit the exact shape and all that and rather than swapping them out for factory tinted tail lights you can tint them yourself and save a lot of money. I've seen the kits running from $7.95 up to $24.95. 
next mod. If you're going to black this out and you're going to black that out, well, what about this? This is an eyesore with all that black back here. You got the body color with all that black going across. Yes, they make blacked out bezels because let's face it, you may want to return this back to factory someday. Everything I'm showing you today is easily turned back in time, put back to factory like if you want to sell the car. Because let's face it, any customized car, the custom parts that you put on it have to meet the, t the taste buds of the person that's going to buy the car if you ever want to sell it. So if you do simple stuff that's, that's easily removed or easily swapped, you put the car back to original, get more out of the car that way, price-wise, and let the next guy decide what he wants to do. But you can buy kits that do just the taillights, like I was showing, like I mentioned earlier. And you want to do the bezels also. The bezels are a little bit more pricey. Like I said, I'll be sure to put all the links and some pictures in so you'll see what I'm talking about. And that will black all that out. Now with all that black, you still have this bright, shiny, chrome looking reverse light. Fastec, as well as some other people, like I said on eBay, depending on where you want to shop, where you want to spend your money, what quality you want, you can actually get the whole kit. You can get the kit to do the side markers, you can get the kit to do the tail lights, you can get the, and, it, and the kit also comes with this. In other words, one kit tints everything. Now that's a little bit more than 50 bucks normally. So that's why I didn't mention it like that. You can do these end steps as your money permits. And it's just, like I said, it's all pre-cut. All you gotta do is squirt it down with a little bit of water, a little bit of soap, put it on there, squeegee it out, and you're good to go. But yes, tinting those also will black out the back end of your car and just make that whole end, that whole rear end match. Make it look super, super clean. They've really grown up, haven't they? <laughs> that's one of their favorite things to do when they're not scourging for food is set on those roosting poles we put in there <laughs> yeah, but they have grown a lot but anyhow that's going to wrap up the under 50 mods that i came up with that i'm planning on doing to my car and that i think look really good i'm not going to sit here and tell you to do something that i think would look cheesy or crappy i mean you can you can scour the internet and find other things that that are under 50 dollars you might want to do i'm just not going to tell you to do them because I, you know it, taste it all comes down to taste beauty is in the eye of the beholder right but that's that's some of the things that i've done to my car i've done the um the bow tie to lead on it before i took it back off just to swap things up the way the car looks and everything and i've done the uh the vinyl wrap on the bow ties and i got a few other things coming like i said and we're just going to leave it at that and i'll show you what they are when they get here but get out there and enjoy your car. Yes, it's cold. Yes, it's been windy all day. Yes, my car is dirty. But I'm sitting here making videos, talking about my car, which I, I really get enthusiastic about doing that. Talking cars to you ladies and gentlemen out there. It's just so much fun. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you find a couple of these little tips useful, a couple of these little mods useful. Like I said, they're super cheap. They're super easy. And it's not going to break the budget. It's not going to break the bank. I mean, you can do this out of... Out of one McDonald's meal, right? A couple of things. So until next time, get out there and enjoy your cars. We'll see you in the next one. And I'm going to be working on an interior mods video just like this. So be on the lookout for that. Until next time, we'll see you later. Thanks for watching.